come here we've got president's day markets closed on monday so let's take a look at what it's going to leave us here so and people get uh, worried about the market doing a reversal you're going to see here on the monthly spy green and taking out last month's highs right so it's exhaustion because we're going into the highs but we've been living in this forever ever since this inside month uh here in the lower middle that's a two up two 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 still going so you look at here in the upper middle look at how tight this range is right so it easily could take out either side of that right if we're going to try and get a reversal they tried to do it here remember on the outside week but then that didn't take it went right back up uh if you go to the upper left you're going to see this inside inside day stock in wednesday's range until that changes uh we're just stuck here but the good thing about stuff like that is oftentimes it makes it a lot easier just to see where they're going uh today you're going to have a lot of crude you're going to have a lot of semis and we'll get to that in a second but let's go to qqq i was going to be re ready for next week and you can see this once again another tight range but closer to the highs in the upper middle and you're going to see this taking out last month's highs in bright green and this stock in here right on the upper middle so there's that and if we just round it out with the diamonds it's handily an inside day today and still a tight range on the week and the small cappers iwm also an inside day so uh that's what's going on but what we've been talking about all week uh going through the uh the strat time reports and the strat attack is the smh and the reason for that is what you're witnessing is called a simultaneous break. And what that what that means is in, in this case, you're going to go in the upper middle. You're going to see the inside week break to the upside, right? We were look, we've been looking for this thing since uh, since last weekend's video and saying, okay, if this if this works, potentially a simultaneous break, and that's hard to turn around. And what that means in this case is that almost every semiconductor is doing this, right? And what that tells us is that they're buying across the board. They're not being uh, selective at all, right? They're saying, give it to me, all of it. And so if you look at something like MU here, once again, the inside week, the two down, inside and back to the highs, these become an outside bar of that, right? So a nice move for MU. You're seeing Intel... Intel continuation had already reversed the previous week by going two up, two down, and then boom, this thing was already going, right? And we'll see if this sets up again for us. And uh, if we go to LRCX, and LRCX once again here in the upper middle, the inside week to the upside, boom, and off she goes. And then here's on the daily what we look for, upper left. Take out the high, take out the low, and then boom, screamer up into the highs for the last few days. Setting like that up on the 60, if they want to take this up a little bit, over 592.18. Uh, right now, not quite there. Market backing off just a tad here. Uh, if we go to a Xilinx. Xilinx, the inside week, upper middle. Inside week to the upside. If we go to microchip, MCHP. There you go. Simultaneous break. Everybody going inside week to the upside. All right. And that means they're buying them across the board. Now, you're running out a week, but uh, we've been talking about this all week. So this should be, uh, shouldn't be be anything new to you if you go to Teradyne. And Teradyne, inside week to the upside. Look at her go. Look at her go. Now you got yourself a nice inside 60. Um, let's see. It. Oops. NVIDIA. It was not an inside week, but finally get out of this range, right? This break helped that finally. Uh, a lot of people get chopped up in here. would never touch this thing. But once you know you have a simultaneous break going on in there, you can you can pick out almost any one you want. Uh, the real screamer today, ILMN. And ILMN now trying to come in a little bit. And you can see it opens somewhat flattish. And even if you just held off to the 30, you're going to see this. We call this country in Western. Inside 30 here to the upside over 509.90. Goes blasting up to 550. Then inside 30 here on a new 60. So you can take that profit and go reverse and get short below 538.86. Because now you have a signal to the downside. And now you're red on the 60. And you can go 2-2 reversal on here below this. Below 534.43 where it is right now. And you go both ways on this thing. And... Uh, that's a good one. All right. We also have crude. 
crude still ripping here. And you can see a nice week last week off the inside week, upper middle. Still going here, going into the recent highs. And once again on the daily, you can see this. Take out the previous high, take out the previous low, and then bam, right there. These two become an outside bar of all that. Uh, we'll see if that can continue. Uh, usually watching the usual suspects over there like PXD, still inside day. How about EOG? And EOG nice, and so you can see in this daily here. Take out the high, take out the low, bam, these two become an outside bar of that, and you also had your inside 60 here. This is what we look for. The outside, inside, off she goes. Uh, let's see, how's NBR doing? NBR still stuck in this range, but we'll see. Watching this market back off just a tad. If we go to ACMR, and ACMR, and you can see this here. Once again, inside week. Not bad, huh? The two down, upper middle. Boom! Off it goes. And so right now, you can see this pattern that we look for again. The 2 2 2 d 2 2 Take out the high. Take out the low. Boom. Now, looking to see for above this, 136.46, to take this out. Make these an outside bar of that. If we go to Thermo, TMO. And TMO, having a nice little push. Today, and you can see this here, upper left, not quite an inside day. So just coming back through the previous range, we like that, right, after stopping them out into here. So potential outside week, uh, you're probably going to run out of time on this, but, but anytime you take out a low and then go out near the highs, we can look for this next week, too, to continue and take this high out. Right now, it's an inside 60 in the lower left. If you go to SEER. S-E-E-R, nice little push here on the weekly. You can see this. This is a two down, and then boom, as soon as it takes this out, above 67.50, you're in. There's your reversal. So now an inside 60, a lot of things might be drying up here. Coming into the long weekend, broader average is backing off just a touch here. Uh, if we go to some more shenanigans, WNW here. And this thing, coming back through the previous range, see all this? Yeah, anybody short against any of this stuff? Just get blown out into here. The question is, can it go? We tried to go inside 60, now coming back up. Looks like we might have to wait for that thing to set up again. If we go to L-I-Z-I -I Lizzie. And Lizzie's still an inside week, but you can see it's got enough range. I mean, here, it's, it comes up, stops everybody out into there. We'll see if that sets up again on you. If we go to the 30. See if we can get an inside 30 like it did down here. You see this? Right there. Off to the races she goes. If we go to I.O. And I.O. And you can see this little newsy spike looks like to me. So now you have an inside 30. Maybe get yourself, maybe grows into a 60. But right now, inside on the 30, and we want to see if it can break back above this and wake up again, above 453 right now. Or try and go back inside on the 30. If we go to, uh, let's Give us some, gives right blockchain. And there you go. Inside week in the upper middle. Nice week for you. And the Bitcoiners off to the races, right? A little tricky up into here, but uh, let's see how the 60s look. Right here. Kicker pattern right there off those guys. Momo hammer right now, right? Because it's into the highs. So we'll see if that sets up again. CAN is also more Bitcoiner stuff. And we'll see how that sets up again for us, too. Um, so it's got about a 30. Let's see. Here's, here's what, right here on this 30. See this? Take out the high. Take out the low. Boom. Right there. Off it goes. We'll see if that sets up. Again, we've also got Chewy. And Chewy here. Upper left. Inside weak to the upside. And then today, inside day, to the upside. All right now, we'll see if that sets up again. Right now, it would be hammer counter shooter in the 30. If you can take this out, two up, two down, hammer over 117.80. So that's where we'd need that in the next half an hour. If we go to LDI. And this thing, new issue, but oh boy, all sorts of fun in this thing. <laughs> all sorts of fun. Here's your inside 60. Look at this. The good thing about this, this takes two hours to set up.
to take out 2903 to go launching up to 3970. Then you mind the flip, the new 60, take the profit, and maybe you get yourself a 30 to come back the other way. Uh, we'll see. And there was a nice little 60 there. If we go to CrowdStrike, and CrowdStrike, once again, the inside week after the outside week. Is that something we look for? Definitely is. Here's also that, the outside day, inside day, and boom, back into the highest crowd strike. Uh, if we go to EXAS, EXAS, and here's another thing we look for. Once again, the outside week to upper middle, inside week. Off she goes and still stuck in here, but you get the launch pad off of this, the daily. The outside bar, right, by taking out both sides. The spike down to stop them out, the hammer. The three, two, two back through because when this goes, we're going to take this thing out because this is a broadening formation and this is going to be an outside bar of that, which it has now achieved. If we go to oh, Baidu. And Baidu just gives us the outside day. And so once again here on the inside, outside, one, three, inside day, pokes down. When this goes green, we're looking for it to go take out that. And maybe it goes further, maybe it doesn't, but uh, certainly a nice little move to grab and do that. If we go to RNG, and RNG, once again here, monthly, we've talked about this. Give me measured move up, inside, off to the race as she goes, and then here's what we look for on the daily. The hammer, the shooter, two up, two down. These two become an outside bar of that, you see? Now we'll see if that sets up again for you. What's going on in Peloton here? Um, getting a request here, TGC, huh? <laughs> Never had that. TGC, huh? Well, you got your inside week to the upside. You're just still an inside month shenanigan. -er. So if you look at the daily, it's probably going to run out of time to be an outside day, but you come in on Monday, you've got or on Tuesday because we're closed on Monday, you got an inside day and poke down. This would be rev strat above today's high on Tuesday. So I will gladly see you Tuesday for a rev strat on Tuesday. If we go to W a day and W a day into the highs, have we been watching this one? We certainly have. Why? Because of the inside month to the upside, right? We know about that. We certainly did. How about Okta Okta? the same right and so we our magnitude's been reached by taking out the highs but then you can see how am i going to get back in on this let them stop them out and then go here so take out previous low and then go green when this thing goes green we're going outside bar right because we got we're green on all time frames boom and there you go outside bar we'll see if that sets up again we still have plenty of month for these guys if we go to eh E-H, get boy, and here's the inside week, and then it pokes down, then when t this goes green on the week, we're looking to take this out, and sometimes good things continue to happen when you use full time frame counter to the upside. You'll see this, the Momo hammer. Anybody who got short yesterday, right, and it comes back up into here, boom, they ran into buyers, stopped out again. So, it would be rev strat 30 here, you can see this, inside bar pokes down, if it could take this out, 119.89 in the next half an hour, otherwise... Maybe inside 60 for you. Yeah, right now an inside 60, so we'll see how that sets up. Broader average is drying up here a bit. We go to VERU. And VERU, once again, here's the rev strat setup. The inside pokes down. Boom. Now we're looking to take out this high. I'm running out of time here, but uh, let's take a look at SOP, S-U-P. Nice little day you got there, a little fast, but uh, bright green, and you can see this. Took that out and then poked down on that. On the downside, you've got GoDaddy, which we liked on the month here, in the lower middle. Took out the high, took out the low, and then it hit magnitude by going into the highs, right? And then what happened? 2-2 two, two reversal back through previous range. We call that the pivot machine gun. Anybody long as long as this, 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 and they're getting mutilated. So we'll see if that sets up. Now you got the inside 60 Momo shooter. DVA, I'm always running out of time. Still the two up, two down month in the middle. Right, and then they come up here, trying to go the out, and boom, back to the previous range, stop them out, now trying to firm up a little bit. Um, if we go just a little bit, XLP uh, weakness over there, just some Pepsi. 
See the Pepsi having a tough tough week going to the lows of the week. Procter and Gamble here also having a problem. That's an inside week and down. Uh, if we go to RH and RH, now you can see the inside week goes up and then it comes back down here, right? So we'll see if this sets up for a rev strat next week. Inside two up, that would be in trouble here if it takes this low out. Uh, let's see. BL, last one. BL, pivot machine gun, coming back through all these guys. Now it's trying to firm up a little bit here. It did its job. It made it an outside week. So you see this middle? Once that thing goes red and starts coming through here, we're going to take that out. Your hopes is you can get worse down into here. That also sets up potential the rev strat month up into here. So everybody's going to have a nice long weekend. I hope you had a great week and have an even better long weekend. It's going to do it for today. I'm Russ with the Smith's Black Channel here. Take your time with the Strat Time Report.